We're gonna come to this tiger sugar. People seem to be drinking this a lot, so I'm gonna try it. And they say the kindest thing you can do is to give to other people, so I'm gonna buy Danny a tea, even though I'm not sure if he wants one. But I'm gonna get him it anyway. I'm that bro. All right. Oh, here we go. This is the easiest thing. They just tell us what is the best seller. So I guess it makes sense to get the, the best seller. So it's brown sugar boba and pearl with cream mousse. That sounds so interesting. Hello, how are you? <laughs> Good. Can I have the most popular one? So it comes to 240. I'm gonna give you 1000, keep the change for you to share. You're working very hard, so for you to share. Okay, that's a good way to get rid of your money. <laughs> but also, yeah, these guys have been working very hard, so it's the least I could do. And you know, I, like I said, I don't, I could easily just go into a shop and buy like a t-shirt, but I don't want to, I want to give it to someone. All right guys, so you can see the order number there, 255. We are one away. You can see like you order there and then you pick up from here. It's gonna be absolutely zabadast, as I like to say. Hello. Thank you, boss. Did it plastic bag for takeaway? Uh, no, it's okay. Thank, Thank you, you, brother. Don't forget to shake 15 times before the drink, sir. Shake 15 times? Yes, sir. Oh, wow, that's very specific. Yeah. If I do it 14, it will taste horrible. Thank you. Thank you. All right, Danny. Shake it 15 times. Oh, yeah. Wow, guys. So, like, the bottom of it is hot and the top is cold. So, they got ice in the top. Wow, that's awesome. Looks so artistic. Make sure you shake it 15 times. Okay, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Oh, I ruined it. Okay. <laughs> Here we go, guys. Looks very milky. You can see it's got some kind of, uh, maybe it's ice at the bottom or it's warm though. So. I'm very intrigued. I've never had something like this before in my life. For real? No. Yeah, it's gold. I've had bubble tea. <laughs> oh, you've got balls in. It's got jelly balls in. What the hell? It's like jelly. Oh my god. That is so cool. Yeah, so guys, the basically it's just like coffee and then in the straw it's like these very small jelly balls. And so you're you have the coffee, you have the liquid, and then you bite on the jelly balls. So it's kind of it's really intriguing and like I've never had anything like this. It's so cool. It's like a really unique Taiwanese treat, I guess. Ali, you love balls, how was that? <laughs> what a way to start. Honestly, this was delicious, man. So obviously I've had their uh, bubble teas before, but I've never had a bubble tea where they have jello, but this one has some sort of honeycomb, mm. fudge sort of thing. It's really nice. Obviously you're drinking it, but as well as that, you get to chew it. I've never chewed a drink before, so it's really, really good. I'm done, you? What's up? <clears throat> Out of 10, how would you reckon, how would you rate it? Solid nine. Mm -hmm. It's freaking good, man. I don't even want to know the calorie content of it. It's like drinking freaking caramel and candy yeah, yeah. <laughs> milk. As uh, Danny was saying, it was probably very calorific, but the good thing is we've been uh, walking around BGC pretty much all day or scootering around all day. I don't think that burns many calories, but we'd ha we've had a very good day either way. <laughs>